So, you just got yourself a brand new Art of Flame grill. What should you do first? That's right, you need to season it. So seasoning prevents corrosion and makes the cooktop non-stick, just like a good old cast iron pan. So first, let's remove the grate with our grate lifter, and let's start building our fire. I like to use a little match light charcoal. You only need five or six briquettes. Once those are lit, then you can go for your wood. Build a teepee out of a few pieces of wood. And unlike me, highly recommended to use gloves at this point. Once that wood is burned down into coals, get your grate back on. Then look for your crispy puck that's included with your Art of Flame and a towel. Just takes a little bit, so move that puck around one time. And let's wipe the film off with the towel. Remember, if you're using a towel and oil, just coat it with a very small layer of oil. We recommend flaxseed oil due to its high temperature threshold, but the crispy puck works fantastic. We're going to do it a second time here once that first layer burn off. So what you're looking for is that cooktop to gradually go from the steel gray to black. Once it's black, you're ready to go. Again, in between layers, let it burn off and very, very light layers of crispy or oil. Because the Art of Flame grill tops are made of carbon steel, they will absorb the oil and the oil bonds to the metal. It actually carbonizes, forming a non-stick film. Let's get one more layer on for good measure. If you use more oil than needed, you'll notice a gummy residue start to build up. The cooktop will be sticky and grimy when in use. So again, very, very thin multiple layers. We'll let this one burn off and we should be ready to go. You can see the difference between the brand new cooktop and a well-seasoned and we're ready to cook.